Now we have all seen baby mamas dragging rappers to court asking for child support. But it looks like this time it's the opposite because Neo is trying to get his baby mama to pay him child support. Oh, child, talk about a mess, y'all. Now we all know Neo's personal life is as chaotic as it could be because there is always some drama happening. And this time, Neo is currently involved in legal drama with his latest baby mama. And he wants her to take a paternity test for one of their two children, change the child's last name to his last name, which is Smith, and hash out a custody and child support agreement. But get this, allegedly, Neo doesn't plan to pay child support to her. He's asking her to pay him child support. So Neo and his wife, Crystal Renee, just reached a divorce settlement. And according to the arrangement, Neo has to give her $1.6 million in cash, one property, $20,000 dollars to help her move, $12,000 in child support, and $3,000 a month in alimony for the next three years. Now, the drama with his ex-wife, Crystal Renee, has been going on for quite a while now. It started when she exposed him for having a baby on her. She wrote, eight years of lies and deception, eight years of unknowingly sharing my life and my husband with numerous women who sell their bodies to him unprotected, every last one of them. To say I'm heartbroken and disgusted disgusted is an understatement. To ask me to stay and accept it is absolutely insane. The mentality of a narcissist. I will no longer lie to the public or pretend that this is something it isn't. I choose me. I choose my happiness and health and my respect. I gained three beautiful children out of this, but nothing else but wasted years and heartache. Neil responded to Crystal's post by saying, for the sake of our children, my family and I will work through our challenges behind closed doors. Personal matters are not meant to be addressed and dissected in the public forum. I simply ask that you please respect me and my family's privacy at this time. Look, fans are going in on Crystal and a lot of them are quick to remind her that he was with Monietta when she got with him. So technically, he cheated with her and she shouldn't be surprised that he would cheat on her. One fan said, hear me out, Neo made his first shorty get her tubes tied because he didn't want children, dumped her, and then married Crystal and had three kids with her. Uh, sis didn't realize something was wrong with him then? And the woman that he had a baby on with Crystal, Sade Bagnarese, well, not one baby, but two. Anyways, as soon as the legal case between him and Crystal finished, he decided to take Sade to court for child support. Yeah, you heard that right. Now, according to the court documents, Neil stated that he believes he is the biological father of his children with Sade. But I guess he's not so sure about the last one because he asked for a DNA analysis to be done on the last one. And that's not all he asked for. He also asked for joint physical custody of the two children, but he wants to have the final say when it comes to the health care and education of the kids. It's clear Neo wants joint custody, right? That means he wants to have the kids for half of the year. Now, we all know Neo is booked and busy with tours, concerts, songwriting, producing, and all the responsibilities that come with owning a record label. So we are not sure how he plans to do all that and still have enough time to spend with the kids. And I don't know if y'all know this, but Neo has seven kids, two with Sade, three with his ex-wife Crystal, and two with his previous fiance, Monetta Shaw. But there's more, y'all. In the court documents, Neo also stated that he has been supporting his two kids with Sade financially and he has been spending enough time with them. But then here is where things get a little weird. While he was in court, he also asked the court to award child support as determined by Georgia child support guidelines on a temporary and permanent basis to each parent when the minor is in his or her physical custody. What that means basically is that Neo wants Sade to pay him child support for the part of the year that the kids spend with him. Now this news shocked a lot of fans and they started speculating as to why Neo would want his side
side piece to pay him child support. And I have to admit, some of their theories make sense. Now, y'all know Neo is super, super successful as a singer and songwriter. I mean, his net worth is nine million, so clearly he's doing good. But what the fans can't seem to understand is why someone that successful would want to be paid child support. But the thing is, Neo has seven kids, y'all, and that's a lot of child support and alimony payments. So here's why the fans think Neo is moving the way he is. One, the more children he can legally claim, the less he is allowed to pay in child support. So it's not surprising that he is asking the court to legally make him the father of Sade's kids. Basically, if you have a lot of kids, the court reduces the amount you pay to child support per kid. Just ask Nick Cannon. Anyways, the fans also think because of how many kids he has, there's a lot of strain on his finances. So asking for child support from his mistress helps him financially. So that way Neil gets to pay his ex-wife less in child support and gets child support from his baby mama. You can say whatever you want, but if this is the case, he's definitely thinking 10 steps ahead. One fan weighed in on the drama saying he is doing that to reduce child support he is paying Crystal. More kids, less child support going to one parent. Other kids have to be taken care of. Another fan said he's definitely doing it right now at this given moment for the sole purpose of alimony and child support owed to Crystal. But then other fans believe Neil is demanding child support from her for payback. I don't know if y'all remember, but Neil had to pay child support for one of his kids with his ex-girlfriend only to find out that one of the kids wasn't his. But because he had signed the birth certificate as the father, he had to keep paying the child support and he still does to this day. So maybe this is his way of getting payback for that child support he still has to pay. One fan said, LOL, I remember he signed the birth certificate for his ex-girlfriend's baby and even though it wasn't his, he still had to pay child support. But Sade did not let Neo get away with his sneaky moves. She fought back with a countersuit, demanding that Neo pay her child support instead. In her countersuit, while she agreed to some of his requests in his claim, when it got to the part where he asked her to pay him child support, she said, nah, uh-uh, get somebody else to do it. She also refused his request for joint physical custody, demanding that the kids stay with her full time while he gets every other weekend along with all alternating holidays. And it looks like Neo's plans to extort money from her failed because she also's requesting he reimburse her a part of all educational, medical, extracurricular, insurance, or any other expenses she had to deal with alone from the moment the kids were born till now. And after that, she asked the court to force Neo to not delete any documents, audio, or video files relating to the case, including text, emails, income tax, tax returns, expense documents, everything, including any other document that he receives for the duration of the time the case is in the court. Listen, Neil tried to play the wrong woman. Sade knew what she was getting herself into when she had two kids with a married man. There was no way she was some naive girl that he could get to foot his very expensive bills. But you know what time it is. Now I want to know what you think about this mess. Is Neo just being petty or is he playing the game so that he has to pay less in child support? Leave your comments below. And if you thought this drama was messy, just wait till you check out the next one.